Try lifting a squat bench deadlift, that's it. All it has to do with is how much you can lift. Train once a day, um, yeah, and I'll be here roughly two hours for four times a week. Uh, my name is Leah Cesare. Um, I live here in Brooklyn, I live in Flatbush. Um, I'm from New York and uh, I power lift. I've been competitively powerlifting for six and a half years. Um, and when I'm not doing that, I'm riding my sports star. <laughs> Powerlifting, you do the back squat, uh, squat the bar is on your back, you squat straight down. The bench press, um, you know, you press the bar to your chest and you press up on the bench. And then a deadlift where the bar is just on the ground and you bend over and you just pick it up and stand straight up with it. I loved seeing like, the image of strong women. I mean, you see them like, in movies and cartoons and whatnot. And, like growing up, I was like, that's what I want to grow up to be. So I'm a massage therapist and a couple before I started, a friend of mine who trained at this other powerlifting gym was like, hey, my coach wants to meet another massage therapist to like network with, link up, send his lifters to, you should go meet him. And I was like, okay, cool, that sounds awesome. And uh, so I went there and I met him and he was just like, why are you here? Want me to teach you how to squat? And I'm like, yeah, sure. And so I did that and then um, he was like, well, why don't you work on me so that I get a sense of your style so I can, you know, talk to people about you. I'm like, yeah, sure. And then after that, he was like, so if you want to just do a skill trade, you know, like you train here and you like uh, work on me whenever I need it, like we can totally work that out. And I was like, cool. So I did that uh, for a couple of years over there and then um, I wound up moving around a couple of different gyms and now I'm here and I work here. <laughs> so uh, I'm, I come from a biker family. My parents met at a bike run in Monticello. It was, uh, so I've always grown up around motorcycles. When I was seven, I told my mom, I was like, I don't want to drive a car. I just want to ride a motorcycle. That's true. I don't drive a car. I only ride a motorcycle. <laughs> a little bit weighed down by, you know, adulthood, responsibilities, blah, blah, blah. I was like, I need to do something that feels fun. It's something that I genuinely want to do. And I was like, kind of racking my brain for like, what excited me about growing up. And I was like, I really wanted to learn how to ride when I was a kid, so uh, so yeah, I bought that bike and um, I went out to Long Island every weekend from like June until November, dragging my poor pops out to the, the driveway and be like, okay, teach me how to, you know, how to do this and, you know, practicing all my circles, my figure eights, and then getting me on the street and then the highway. And then finally when it was time, when a road test came around, I took it, we're good, uh, and I've been riding whenever it is warm enough ever since. <laughs> I have, a, I have a competition coming up in about two weeks. Uh, it's right here in Gowanus, and um, it's just a, it's a smaller powerlifting meet. You know, it's like 60 lifters. Um, it'll be fun. It's like another opportunity for me to maybe try to best myself, um, and then kind of see where I'm at on the road to going to nationals. Good luck. Thank you. In December, I weighed in at 99.6 pounds and I squatted 265, I benched 160, and I deadlifted 287. Yeah, so, you know, if I, if I do a little bit better than before, then I'd be happy. If I don't, it's also fine. When you compete, you have three attempts. I'll choose something that I know I can hit for like a com comfortable set of three for my opener. And then my second attempt of, might be like something close to the most I've hit in the gym, or maybe about that much. And then my third might be like, depending on how I'm feeling, it might be a weight I've never tried before and just like put it on the platform, see if it happens. Yeah. You know, if you're gonna do it anywhere, might as well be there.
I have a Harley uh, 883. I, I like that it's a little loud. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. It feels like me. It, it just does. It's like it's a it's a, a tiny little loud Spitfire like me. <laughs>